Right, welcome to Beta Mao. Today we're going to be replacing a gear stick on a T5 transporter. Okay, the issue with this one, the reason I'm replacing it, it's looking a bit tatty anyway, but also this is sheared off, which is a bit of a pain. So I'm going to show you what to do now. Kit, you're going to need your replacement gear stick with the knob. It will come with a spring and then a little crosshead screw for this one. And this is the place I got it. So just pause the video. I'm going to see where I got it from. Diamond Performance for Auto, where I ordered it off. Tools. You're going to need one of these star tip, size 30. I can go on your ratchet. And then just a flathead screwdriver. First things first, you're going to take your flathead screwdriver, you're going to pop it under this little top bit here, and then take that off, and that's going to give you access to the screw that's held in. Next, take your star tip, pop it in the screw, and then begin to undo. Once you've undone the screw, take it out and then this bit will pop off and you'll notice that's the old spring holding it in place there. Next thing is to get remove this little lever thing here. So this is where your flat tip screwdriver will come in handy again. There's little lugs under here so you want to get under and prise it off so get right in there and then you should be able to pop it up on one side and then once you've got that bottom corner done I'm going to do the other corner and then you should be able to slide it off right so I've got under there under the other side now I should be able to slide this whole thing off and that's what you're left with so we're going to get our new parts now and put them in place in reverse order. So with the new lever bit, what you want to make sure, you just want to make sure the thicker bit on the bit you're going to hold for reverse is at the bottom. Slide it over the top and in place and you should find it should sit all the way down. Okay, if you have it at an angle, you won't be able to push it all the way down. So I've got my new spring. Pop that over the top. New gear knob, pop that over the top. Just make sure that the spring's working, which it is. And now I can fix the screw in place. Right, let's tighten the screw in place. I've just quickly run through a gear check. Just make sure it's all working, particularly into reverse and it's not slipping out first and second so on. So now last thing, I can pop the plastic tab back on. We're good to go. As always if you liked the video and found it useful please like, comment and subscribe and I'll look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thank you.